I am in Valencia and here's our ship. Um, I'm going on a field program this morning. So I believe at 845, it's like 826, 825, around that time. Um, I had to rush out because she said we needed to meet by the bus. So I had to finish eating breakfast and run out here to catch this bus. But it's a it's cool, but it's gonna be hotter out today. Um from the looks of it, because we're I'm looking at port. The architecture from far away looks really nice per usual with every port that or any place I've been to so far. Sorry y'all, I'm out of breath because I just hauled but out of this port and it's a long way from port to get out or whatever. But yeah guys, hopefully, okay. So I'm doing like this cave thing and we're canoeing I guess. So I will, I don't know if I'll be recording because I don't have a waterproof phone case but I do have like this waterproof case that I have so maybe like I'll have to record click and then like record through the bag but I think like the quality of the video will be messed up so I don't know if I'm gonna do that but yeah guys I'll catch you later sorry this vlog is so choppy <laughs> bye Okay, so we're at the, I don't know how to pronounce it, but I'll put it right here. We're going to the caves. Um, they said that we can't take pictures, but they didn't say we couldn't record, but I'm gonna just follow their rules and try and, I'm not gonna get like any footage of the cave, so. Sorry you can't see me, the sun is facing this way. Um, but afterwards, we're gonna get d lunch, not dinner. Um, but we're like in the countryside of Valencia. I think it's called Castillos. I don't think I'm saying it right, but again, if I'm saying it wrong, put it down here. But yeah, um, there's a lot of people around here now. But I'll see you guys probably another 45 to 50 minutes. Okay, so we just got from the caves. Um, it was a different name on our ticket, but it's, I believe it's called Coles, uh, I'm looking at her bag, De Saint Joseph. Um, like I said, we couldn't like record or take, take pictures and stuff. Where is that? Where is it? Okay. I'm not, I can't. I wanted to like check out this. Yeah. So we did, we weren't able to record or anything like that, but my friend got the group picture. It was six euros. It was cool. But it was a nice place to calm you down and just look at historical rocks, I guess. But now we're going to the souvenir place. Okay, so now we're having lunch at this place called... Hi. <laughs> you don't know me, but I'm Isaac. This is Isaac. <laughs> right. I'm from Indiana. Corn. <laughs> Okay, so we're in this place called Pipa, and it's just like the place we just went through with the rivers, like the caves, it's cool. Hola! Hola! It's a cool atmosphere here. Um, yeah. The caves reminded me of Disney World, so everything, it looks so fake, but it was real, so it tells you that that Disney World is, is up there with their like reputation of different things. So I'm gonna sit this right here so I get some hand sanitizer. Oh, some hand right, there you yeah, thank you. <laughs> you know. Okay, one moment, please check in. Any vegetarian? No. Gluten free? No. No gluten free, no vegetarian. Right. Right. So um, hey. yeah, Disney. So I like. The difference is like Disney World is fake, so yeah. So it's like 
Yeah. It was so like weird because it looked just like a ride at Disney World. But anyways, we're about to eat and I guess we about to end. Bye. 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 <laughs> Y'all. I don't know how I feel about this, but we were just informed it was rabbits and a paella. I will insert a picture here. Mind you, did you take a picture of her? No. She had like a, a type, a piece of meat, and she was like, maybe this is like the, the, the butt bone of a chicken or a neck, but it probably was rabbit. This is, so, I feel, it's very disturbing, but it's a part of their culture, so, you know, do it for the culture, but I don't know how I feel about eating rabbit. So, but it did taste like chicken, I mean, I don't know, but yeah, so, she probably had rabbit, I don't know if I did, but I don't know how I feel about it, so I'll give it to y'all later. <laughs> Okay, so we are at the bus stop going back to the place that we had toured today because they had things there in the tour, you know, you can't really stop to take like personal, well you could take pictures, but it's not pictures with you and them and all the detail and stuff like that. So, yeah, then she's like ready to go. So, we're going to go back, probably, I want to get a pen and take more photos and then we might go to the aquarium museum after that so we're just gonna ride the wave of the day and see where it takes us but yeah we're about to get on the bus Hey guys, I know it's been a while. I don't even know what was the last thing I talked about. It probably was the rabbit. I don't know. But, <laughs> but we, um, we walked, we went back to the ship and then walked next to like this beach strip. We ate, had deep conversations and now we went to, we was going to the M Club but they don't open until 2. So we was like, that's a dub, but um, they're sitting here getting liquor from the liquor store. Well, not her because she's out here with me. Yeah. But nobody, I'm not drinking because I feel like I'm getting sick. So, plus I'm really not about that life. This man been dancing since I don't know when. And he get lit all the time. So, yeah. So, that's what they're doing right now. It's like 11 something at night and people are walking around. Y'all can't see. Double zero zero, quadruple zero. Oh, well, it's 12 o'clock at night. Well, midnight, a.m., whatever y'all want to say. So, yeah, my phone's about to die, so that's why I haven't been recording. So, I guess I'll talk to y'all later because I feel like I'm going to say Good morning guys, me and Gina, we're at the beach and it is nice out here and the sand is clean. It's not like the dirty Jersey beaches, which I really don't go to because it's litter everywhere and the water sometimes be dirty, depending on what beach you go to. Point Pleasant is the spot, but yeah. <laughs> but it's like calm, it's early in the morning. Um, Yeah, cause this sand. But I'm gonna like show y'all the picture of the water and stuff later because this is cute. My first time at a foreign beach, you know, I'm really enjoying it so far, even though we just walked up here. So I'll update y'all on what we're gonna do next. And I'm gonna be probably like three shades darker when we come back. So <laughs> peace. Okay guys, so we found this little cute spot on the beach. It's so pretty y'all. And I'm gonna have to do this old school way, so I don't know if I see myself. But 
I just learned something. Well, I knew like in Europe, like they do new beaches and stuff and they're okay with nudity. But me just sitting down, um, it's, it's happening now and I just don't, I just feel like I should say something. But, um, <laughs> like this, mind you, it is kids on the beach, y'all. This lady is like, she don't have like her, her top on and she has her bottoms on and she's like putting on suntan lotion, like, okay. But she just has like titties out and everything. Like usually like we don't do that in America. So it's kind of like, oh wow, like they're just free, like they're liberating, like they don't care. Like it's it's nothing like foreign to them like it is to me. So I'm just saying, look at them two people. All you see is their heads. You see them? All the way in the back? Yeah. In the water? Yeah. Yeah. Um Yeah, so it's like I, I can roll with this, you know. And then plus, like, back at home, you have to pay for stuff like this. For everything. Like, for everything. It would be, like, $20 for each chair and $50 for an umbrella. Like, but and we have to pay to get on the beach. Oh, my God. Like, everything is free. <laughs> free 99. <laughs> Except for drinks. But, <laughs> like, we literally have to pay for everything back home. Like, and it's so crazy how, like, everything is so accessible and free here. That's why America is in debt now, and we just suck. I'm sorry, we do. So I'm going to enjoy the rest of my day and get comfortable and enjoy this beautiful view. Okay, guys, so it's like three hours after we came from the beach, but we went to go eat. And we're just being complicated Americans because we like our food a certain way and they don't no make it that way. We, boy, bah! <laughs> so, so, yeah, we were all Ain't no picky eaters. <laughs> yeah. Ain't no weirdness. No weirdness. So, uh, so, um, yeah, so this is our last day. We're about to go dock this shit for uh, eight days on the sea. Eight days? Huh? You have a walker, so that's not far to me, but you could take the bus. No, we're just going to walk. Okay. I don't know where we ended off, but yeah, we're going to Ghana next. I don't know when this video is going to be up because our service sucks and my phone don't want to work unless it has Wi-Fi. Um... That's Gina again. Yeah, guys, Valencia was really nice. Are you vlogging? Yeah. Valencia was really nice. The beach, oh my god, it was so beautiful. Like, it was like glitter in the water. I know it sounds dumb, but it was. It was glitter in the water, and you could see clearly, like, through, like, you were deep in the water. You could still see the bottom. Also, at the end of the day, we did have to pay for the cheers and umbrellas. And. <laughs> And uh, they finessed us out of our like US dollars, but I mean, it was worth it in the end. And then, what else did I want to tell y'all? Oh, yeah, I did it for the culture and I went topless because it was a lot of topless people there. But like, I did it like low key, like, I just felt uncomfortable just letting it all out. Plus, it was little kids there, but it was like grown, like old people, like letting it they tatas all out but it was a part of the culture so i did it for the culture um yeah it's really nice see the palm trees looks like la oh i should take a picture okay so yeah we're about to go on the ship tier tier but our next stop is ghana and we're really excited you know, I've seen him, but so yeah, everybody's in the back talking, whatever. It's not whole squad, but later on, I'm gonna do a reflection at all at the end of all my videos because I thought about it after Germany. I'm like, dang, I didn't do a reflection, and I think I should do a reflection after each port just to see like my experience and where my head is at. So yeah, that should be the last thing that you see after this video. If not, just keep watching, y'all.